Yeah, so there's quite an interesting backstory to this. We're a construction company, we're doing a big job around Leeds on the M621, and we were doing some site clearance, and we realised that it was quite overgrown. As the guys got round to doing the site clearance, there was something in the way, and when we lifted some tar tarpaulin, there were people living rough on the edges of the motorway under tarpaulin. So it got us thinking about uh, needing to do something and something with the community because it was quite a shock to most of our guys that people live like this. We also found out that because we use heavy plant, which stays warm for quite a while, it was actually attracting homeless people to take refuge under the warm plant. So we needed to brief our staff to say, Whatever you do in the mornings, the first thing you do before you do any work is to check around your plant. That's what we call diggers and excavators and things. Yeah, to check that there's nobody uh, of a vulnerable nature actually climbed in or climbed under the machinery. So that's why we got involved. St George's Crypt was the key uh, route in, but then they pointed us in the direction of the big sleep. So for us as a company, it's important to, to give back to the people on the e We're delivering work on the M621. Um, obviously, it has a lot of impact on people that live and work in the city. So we're just really keen to, to sort of help and to support where we can. I think, I think it's really important that businesses like ours seek to leave a legacy beyond what we're doing. There will be a legacy associated with better traffic conditions, easier traffic, but that's only a tiny fraction of the community. So I think it's really it's sort of part and parcel of what all businesses should be doing when they're in an area to make sure that when they leave the area is enhanced up and above the situation when we came into that situation. Definitely I think for, for us the thing we found was we, we kind of went with a bit of trepidation last year thinking it was going to be sort of very much kind of sleeping out on the, on the stadium in the stadium which it was. Um, it was cold but there was a, a tremendous kind of um, sense of team building. Yes, of course we are. We probably won't get the same group of people as we had last week, because last year, because once bitten twice shy, but we will do what we can, and uh, I'm sure we'll come away with it with the same stories, same people snoring, and uh, lots of great memories.